I've always been a big fan of his, really, really study his teams, how he handles things. And here, here's, here's the part that, uh, uh, that I just absolutely love about Coach Saban. Um, everyone says it's hard to repeat. The reason it's hard to repeat is because everyone starting with the head coach gets a little fat from success. Um, you know, and the one thing he doesn't do is get fat from success. Uh, every day is a new challenge. Every day is an exciting drive to get better, to improve. Um, he doesn't get consumed with uh, what I call outside noise. He gets consumed with inside noise. And um, it's, uh, what, what, to be able to maintain the level of excellence that, uh, that guys like Coach Saban are, are, are able to do. You know, I grew up watching Don Shula, you know, as a young kid. And I just marvel at their ability to, to, to not allow previous success to impact their enthusiasm to motivate and teach that following day or the following year. Um, you know, I, I had a friend said, you know, I, in high school we, we won a state championship in 96 and one of my closest friends said to me, I, you know, how are you going to get these guys excited about 97? I said, well, if I'm not excited. How the heck am I going to expect them to be excited? And if I allow them to work less, how are they going to accomplish more? Uh, so it's a... Uh, I'm I'm a big big fan, you know. At the SEC spring meetings, we always spend a couple minutes together, and uh, he's always been very complimentary. And uh, Anthony Grant being at Alabama uh, during Coach's tenure was was uh, uh, you know uh, conversate you know just kind of led us to have conversations. And uh, I'll tell you what, he doesn't get credit for how giving he is to organizations and to helping others in the communities, just not just in Tuscaloosa, but countrywide. It's, uh, um, he, he's, he, he's driven to succeed. And uh, I don't know about other people, I, I don't like being around people that are not driven to succeed. I like being around people that, that are fearless of the work and the difficulties uh, that success, that requires to have a chance to succeed, and that comes with success. And that's how he's wired, and I try to pursue that every day myself.